Hi, my name's Amanda O'Brien. I'm the Chairwoman of the Supply Chain and Logistics Association of Australia. We are the largest association in Australia. We have over 5,500 members. I've had a very varied background. There's been project management, there's been management, there's been senior management roles um, in blue chip companies and also affiliated with large freight companies. It's been a real mix of jobs and that adds variety to your ability to compete in a marketplace that's forever changing and evolving. I mean, there's always KPIs to meet and a job description to match, but I don't believe that that can ever hold an individual back and it doesn't matter what silo you're working in, in with whatever corporation, you can make that job your own. As an organisation, we work in a very competitive market, so it's really important that we collaborate with the people within our country, within our states, within our communities, so that we can raise the standards and best practices for sustainability and for communication. And they're evaluated by various metrics throughout the supply chain. So you have to make sure that you're working with your industry peers to share knowledge and to encompass that high standard of delivery. And what we want is an end-to-end -end seamless logistics experience or supply chain experience. And we can only do that by working with our peers who have industry knowledge of those different facets of the supply chain. It's an evolving practice. It's always looking at new ways that we can assist our end customer. We actually carry the reputation of the customer on, on our shoulders. So if we can work as a long-term partner and integrate our solutions to help them, then we find that we've got more viability and also more of a professional outlook in the marketplace. It's a really competitive environment but we've tried to attack the market in a different way and we've also tried to keep a level of professionalism and reporting that I don't think has been seen with other transport companies in Australia in the last 10 years. So I think that's our competitive advantage.